now we are going to talk about uh, the the stock monitoring based on supplier so me2o is the transaction code before we discussed about me2on subcontract account so this one is subcontracting stock monitor okay it's based on supplier so here if you want you know we are running for plant 1710 why it's coming as i said we have set the parameter id su3 if you notice <coughs> to plant 1710 that's why it's coming okay so now what you can do is you go here now what we are going to do we are going to execute this okay and here you can see these are the different uh, subcontract orders okay so this is car dashboard excel so let's click the excel one okay and from here you can see you can do a ports goods issue based on storage location and all those things you can create a delivery also so if i click on this okay and i can create a delivery okay so that's pretty useful then you can also check the stock overview so if you click on the stock overview it takes you to the stock overview portion where you you can see what happened so here if you double click on it it will take stock provided by the unrestricted stock this is the amount everything is there then the quality inspection is done or not so this is the unrestricted stock so you can you can do a lot of stuff here this is pretty useful this is your stock overview the basic list okay. now if I go to display the materials so if I go here it will take to me to mm03 to display the material okay so it's taking me there tells me all this information the basic unit of measure the old material number and all those things so it's pretty useful so from here you can see the open purchase orders okay so if I click on the open purchase orders it will take me to this if I double click see from one transaction I went through so many different places so it's very useful just to tell you so from here if I go I can go to header changes supply evaluation source list purchase requisition let me go since it's a since it's a material so I can see what is this is the info record okay so the quality info record does not exist so that's fine we'll go here and we can see the supplier so the supplier the funny part of this supplier will take me to the bp transaction okay so it says M, though it says mk03 takes me to the bp transaction so if you see we went from there to purchase order so so here also you can see stock open purchase order if i go into see the material movement we can see the material movement what was done so these are the different material documents that got posted okay so this is pretty useful then let's see what you can do so you can see the batch display the batch display of stock can be from batch level downwards okay so there is nothing here so we can see the serial number also equipment serial number if the material is having one so it's searching so probably it will have some so so you can see the external manufacturer here the type of material is raw material the unit of measure is each okay and so this is taking some time probably there is a lot of recruitment classification so let's for the heck since it's taking time we'll just create another session okay and we'll just execute the same thing supplier will tell this and this time we'll do by only with shortage i will say display zero lines also okay so let me take this supplier display zero lines i take this so if you see this this is now different so we were taking up the axle let's go here and if i go 
to the stock overview that's where we were okay so so now if i go to see the reservations so if there is any reservations available uh so it's probably saying uh, let's go here it's not showing here on here so from so we'll hit the back button we'll click here again we'll go to stock requirement list okay and here you can see the requirements so receipt is four minus available quantity 60 so from here you can see total requirement display you can display the materials you can do a lot of stuff okay so what is this own favorite maintain so you can create your own favorites so that's pretty neat so we were in this transaction uh, no objects were selected so there's nothing so let's see the handling unit if there's any so we can find the handling unit and this is the stock requirement this is not what we wanted here from here you can see the vendor is the vendor if i double click it will take me to the vendor mk03 which will take me to bp transaction so from here you can see the purchasing group so this is the purchasing group so uh, if I click on the purchasing, if there is any other purchasing group, which is not in this case, you, you can see different things. You can see the partner function, ordering address, uh, paying address, okay, the VN, the interchangeability. Uh, so this is also this is used for the pricing procedures. Okay, so let's go into this portion and it has stock overview and so here i'll go back and let's see this negative one okay so if you see this was done this on this view so if the greatest thing is every time i double click it takes me to the correct transaction which is pretty useful and which is slick so here you can see all these things that has happened so it's pretty useful and so this one tells us everything about the subcontracting stock monitoring for source supplier and, uh, and and it's pretty useful you can create delivery you can do puts goods receipt let's try to do puts goods receipt i think the, the only problem is i think the the posting period is not open so that's the problem and we'll just put one if i can change the posting period yeah this is posting only possible in this in company so so that's the problem you cannot post from here so see it's wind so yeah so let me see can i delete this reservation this also so if there's anyone now this select reservations delete no there's no reservation available so i cannot do so can i create a delivery delivery will have the same problem the posting creates mm -hmm. so yeah not defined so it has problems here but this is a pretty useful transaction code where you can do the subcontracting stock monitoring for suppliers and this would be heavily used for your stock processes uh, monitoring the stock based on suppliers